Hi, Pete Moore, editor of Shoot Sports Magazine. I'm on the blaster stand. I love blaster. I love blaster rifles. I'm not a shotgunner, but everybody knows about the F3, which is a cracking blaster sports shotgun. They've got something different, which I think will appeal to the greater mass of shotgunners. It's called the F16. Darren here from Blaser. For a long time. Mr. Darren, could you please tell us about this new gun? Sure, my Pete, good to see you. And you, mate, as always. Yeah, quite often we had people come over for the F3, fantastic shotgun, but there's just no way I can pay that amount of money for the gun. Yeah. So we looked at this again. Um, the F16 comes in two models, it comes in a game and a sporting model. Uh, we have the game model. Yeah. Um, the game model has uh, the silver inlay in here has an, a, a nickel bead on the front for, for the game version. Yeah. Uh, the game version weighs 3.1 kilos and you have barrel lengths of 28 and 30 inch. That's good. So it is as it is out, out of the box, transport case, three chunks at 2,500 pounds. 2,500? Yeah. Nice. That's going to give Browning a serious run for their money. Yeah, 2,550 for, for the game gun. Yeah. Um, while we was in the development of that, uh, obviously there was plans for the, for the sporting model as well, yeah. which is this one here. There you have the red inlay for that and a uh, high speed on the front. Uh, this comes in uh, 30 and 32 inch barrels. Uh, and it's also, as with the F3, uh, with the balancing system. So yeah. if, I, if I remove the forearm, you've got yeah. the additional yeah. weights that you can put on there. Um, you also have the additional weights in, in the stuff. Yeah. It looks also, very F3. The action looks very low to me. It's the shallowest action yeah. there is. Yeah. So, yeah. Cosmetically, optic, it looks absolutely fantastic. Yeah. Very low shallow, very rounded, um, very appealing. Fantastic shotgun. Uh, also, the trigger and the sporting version is yeah. adjustable in the, in the length of the port. We have two stock heights. There's uh, the standard, which would be your typical looking straight directly over yeah. the rib, and then for the UK market, the 3850 stock, which is slightly higher. Yeah. Will they do fancy grades on this? Um, no, it's going to stay uh, oh, pretty much as it will be as, a, as much as a grade two, yeah. and it will go up to a grade four. There are other models, as in a prestige and a luxus model in the planning, yeah. but at the moment that's that's going to be how it will go. It's uh, up to the grade four, and the F3 remains a specialist in that. If you yeah. want high ribs, different stocks, higher grades, more engravings, that's that's all going to remain on that side. I've got to say, I, I'm, I'm no double gunner, but that's, that is a nice handy shotgun, and I reckon that's going to clean up perhaps more than the F3 because of the price alone. Got it's a, a different brand. market, yeah. it's a different market. There are a lot of people out there that, that yeah. Yeah, will maybe aspire to the F3, but there's no way financially they can go down there. And here you've got a, a fantastic price, the, the, the Sporting comes out at 2780 um, Great for the, for the product, it's a good looking gun, we've got the balance system on there. Um, it's it's gonna, life. Uh, the ejector system is, is similar with the, with the yeah. F3. It's a, a, a good all-rounder. It's great. Is that that? Thanks, mate. Thank you. Good to see you. Good to see you.